Previously on Milky Metopia, Milky Chan and the gang continue their search for the four keys of chaos so that they may reach Omega Ouija, high up in the clouds. While uh, searching for the keys, they met up with a mysterious scientist by the name of Dr. Robotnik, and they've traveled to the city high in the clouds. But what waits for them there? A trap or a forward in their adventure? All of these questions and more shall be revealed in this episode of Milky Metopia. But first, Milky Chan and the gang have received a letter. It's from Jules! Dear Milky Chan, hello, are you well? My sisters and I are fab. Come visit us in the Elven Retreat sometime. Did you give us four tickets? I also don't need my lighting equipment blasting my eyeballs while I'm here. So, uh, yeah, welcome to Milky Metopia. If you guys don't know what this is, uh, this is a story about our channel's mascot. This is her origin story about how she became the Milky Finisher's mascot. And this is her adventure with Mario, Link, Sans, Jotaro, Midna, and everybody else uh, as we travel to stop Ouija. And how fitting that Ouija keeps getting delayed in real life and in this world. So let's see what they've been up to. Ah, yes. It just seems just like yesterday since we've seen them all. So here's our gang, if you guys were wondering. Uh, here's the full party for those of you guys who have never seen the episode. Also, if you do want to watch some of the old episodes, they're all up on the Milky Archives, which is our second YouTube channel, in a nice playlist. So you can start from episode one if you're ever bored. We have Mario. We have uh, Marie from Splatoon. Sans. Uh, Chaos-chan. The Dark Titan. Jotaro. Milky-chan. Bomb True Girl. Link and Midna, and then uh, Dr. Robotnik is traveling with us, and then we also have Epona as our horse. So. Uh, but we're not going to dilly-dally around. We're going to just jump on in. Who, who's our party? Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we were running around this, like, factory, and we didn't know where to go. Okay. Okay, I think this is where we need to go. Oh, my nose has been stuffed up because the spring sucks. I like this area. So yeah, if you're wondering why we're here, we're looking for a key. Because in order to get to Ouija, who is the main villain, we need to find four keys. I think we found one or two. I don't remember, actually. I think maybe we found two. Wow, this building. It's all shiny and sparkly. I forgot that they live in like a fantasy world, so seeing science stuff must like freak Milky Chan out. <laughs> That's right. This is where the robots are made. The robots are ultra high tech machines. They can only be built in extremely clean places. How perfect for a Robotnik, right? Wow. Even the tiniest speck of dust is not permitted. Good thing I wore clean clothes. Yeah, this place is bright, dude. It's like hurt my eyeballs. It's like turning down the brightness on this place. Here we go. So yeah, all the enemies are like, like, I, like we have the robot. Don't the robotic penguins kind of look like Spamton? Now is your chance to be a big shot. The robot penguins remind me of Spamton. I, mean, I just hate the weather because, uh, whoops, it's making my, like, teeth hurt. I forgot that Mario keeps leveling up. I remember when he used to be the weakest character and now he's pretty much just as strong as everybody else. You're not rich enough to have Spamton's emote? That's why he's a big shot. Damn, was... Ew, barbecue. Ew, this is gross food. Fish and scorpions. Where's like all like the pasta and sandwiches? Yeah, Mario leveled up, dude. Wow, I like how all of them are robots, except for then you have a Cloud and a Lizalfos. Alright, we'll turn it up. 
bust this guy up. How do you use the Spamton emote? It's a bit emote. So if you give enough bits, you can use it. And before you guys roast me, that's Twitch's fucking idea, dude. I didn't. I just made it as a joke. I just made it as a joke. Dang, dude, he's doing a spin attack? I just noticed that the bomb shoot girl just got smoked. <laughs> I like how Milky Chan's praising Link when she's angry. Uh. I probably should have put her in the pout spot, but I figured they were probably almost dead. Come on, Link, finish him off. Let her be angry? True. It's good. They, they did knock out Bomb Chew Girl. I guess I'd be pretty angry, too. There we go. The Bomb Chew Girl is temporarily incapacitated. Damn, she looks so sad. Look at her. Aw, oh, it's okay. Ta-da. Hey, actually, somebody did bring up a good point now that we have the Milky Chan emote. We technically uh, have an emote of every single character that's in this party right now. Not like the whole game party. But like we have an emote of Milky Chan, Link, Mario, and Bomb Chew Girl. So now we have the, like, the whole game. Yeah, right? That's why I made it Spamton, because I figured like if there had to be an emote that was locked behind a paywall, uh, Spamton would be the best one, because he always talks about Cromer and Big Shot, so I was like, well, sure, might as well make that one the, the bonus emote. And honestly, it's not even like a, an original emote, it's just, I just edited a picture of the Happy Mask Salesman. Why do Sans and Chaos Chan sort of like each other? That's kind of cursed. Right. Move on. We have much to do. This game is already like 28 episodes in. This is slowly approaching the longest playthrough ever. I think we're like five episodes away from this being officially the longest playthrough we've ever done, which is kind of crazy. I definitely would never have expected that when I first started this game. Link is like, the journey continues. You said it, buddy. This place is absolutely fantastic. Now then, where are we to find this jewel? Oh dear me. <gasps> no! Dr. Robotic's face, bro! What on Robot Earth? Dr. Eggman, no! Oh god. Yeah, I, I wish he didn't have the hair. Oh, that's actually perfect. Robotnik Eggman? That actually looks like a, a robot Eggman would have. Oh, God, this boss fight is perfect. This boss fight is literally perfect. <laughs> Sonic, I swear I shall defeat you, annoying hedge hedgehog. Oh, shit. Well, now we're definitely whooping his ass. We must defeat Dr. Robotnik. Wouldn't it be funny if Sonic showed up to take a picture? Because Sonic's the photographer. Dude, I would like... What is this? Wait, what the hell did I just... I looked away from the chat for a second. Shield sprinkles? Give him me a one-time protection. Oh, shit. This far into the game, we're still getting new abilities? The dude from the Sonic movie will be Eggman in the next movie? What? Jim Carrey? Didn't he say he was going to retire? Oh, the guy who worked for Robotnik. Ah. <laughs> Being targeted by an enemy, you'll take a big hit if you don't do something. But don't worry. Using the shield, the rise of the shield sprinkles. I feel like Rise of the Shield Hero is kind of an underrated anime. 
because I enjoyed the hell out of it when I watched it, and I should watch the second uh, season. But I got enough shit to watch, dude. I gotta finish all the anime already on my list. That's kind of cool how it shows the targets. Yeah, right? We're gonna need the shield ability for Ouija, so let's protect Bomchu Girl. Oh, look at her. She's protected. And now we're gonna protect Mario. And now he can't do shit, boy. We're also gonna just boost up. We're gonna give Mario meth, too. Let's meth him up. Oh, yeah! Alright, now he's methed up. I'm ready. Uh oh, then they're all going in. Link's got the Master Sword, he's got the Dark Ice Slash! I forgot that he learned, like, the Sheikah Slash. No, Link Cannon, no! <laughs> Damn, dude, he whooped. He gets smashed his face. Meth Mario fan art, that's so cursed. Uh, He's gotta be dead after this, look at this. Milky Chan's using her anime move. I love Milky Chan. Wait, they didn't believe you that Shadow was in the credits? That was like the best part of the movie, dude! The supersonic and the Shadow part was the best. We are whooping Eggman's ass, dude. Shield didn't do nothing. He started charging. Dude, I cannot believe how hard we're going, dude. We're, I feel like we're ready for Omega Ouija. We're like unstoppable, dude. Darker Lord Gino. Well, Ouija possessed Gino, but it's still Ouija. It's still Ouija, but he just sucked away Gino's energy. So after we get this next gem, we'll only have one more, right? The game's gotta be ending after this. The game has to be ending after this, because... We already had the fake out. We fought Ouija, and then now we have Omega Ouija. And how do you get crazier than Omega Ouija in the Tower of Chaos above the fucking world, dude? Like, this, this has got to actually be getting close to the end. The game will never end? Oh, God. I know some people in the chat would like that, but as much as I love this game, I actually do want it to end. You know? Every good story needs an ending. I'm sure we'll see Milky Chan again. We'll see her again, but... You're here to eliminate the Kring. What was ass? That was like the easiest boss ever. Most impressive! Did we win? Man, we got hella XP. Yeah, we got Robo Juice. I don't even know what that would taste like. Probably not very good. Ta -ta -ti -ta -ra -pa 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 -pa. Why does he have two noses? He's got a nose on him and he's got a nose coming onto him now. He's double nosing it. Yes, well, we're doing more Zelda on Sunday. Am I back to normal? To think that I, the great Dr. Robotnik, a skull of robotics, nearly became a robot. Who'd have thought such a thing possible? Oh yes, while you're here, it was around here, wasn't it? Oh, is this what you were after? Yes, that's it! How f Wow, how fitting that the nose jewel would look like Dr. Robotnik's nose. Perfect. Well, here, please take it. You finished Dr. Eggman's quest. Woohoo! That's it! This is the third, so we only have one more! Dude, the story's getting finally close to the end! We only need one more jewel to get to Ouija's tower. I'm sure Ouija's tower is good. Remember when we thought like we were about to fight Ouija, and then we went into the Castle of Infinite Darkness, and that was three episodes? So I'm sure the tower is gonna be like nine episodes in the tower. It's gonna be like 99 floors of, like, insanity. So it's gonna be the, the tower arc. Tower of God.
Just one more and the door will open. And then Omega Ouija will get his comeuppance. And we'll have Great Sage Ouija. Onward, team. You actually just missed her. Jules sent us a letter at the beginning of the stream. As soon as the stream started, Jules sent us a letter. Da, da, da. Well, before we move on, I think now's a good time for like... Oh, wait. Oh, what the hell? Did somebody get coronavirus? Sans got the coronavirus? We gotta play Sad Alovania. Damn, dude. This is, isn't this the second time Sans got COVID, bro? Where's... Here we, here we go. <laughs> it was nice knowing you, good friend, but San seems to have gotten sick. We will never see him again. Just kidding, bucko. No, he's just fucking with us. He's just lazy, dude. He's not actually sick. He's just lazy bones. <laughs> Alright, whatever. We were, he wasn't doing shit anyways. Exactly. He's just being lazy. He doesn't need that actually sick. He's just tricking us. Well, before... Uh, now that we're done with the jewel... Uh, here's some head cannon. Now that there, there's only one jewel left, they're all gonna celebrate. So here comes a little bit of a filler. We're gonna be hanging out with some of the characters. Uh, before we de uh, depart for the next adventure. What do they want? Oh, Milky Chow wants armor. That's a must. Gotta get our main girl the strongest stuff. Super lab gear. That looked like shit. <laughs> Oh, well, that one doesn't look bad. She was like super white Milky Chan. But no. I like her blue shirt. Also, if you guys like this stream, if you guys like this uh, stream series, I highly recommend that uh, on June 5th, Sunday, June 5th, you tune in to Milk Caliber. It's pretty much like the Milky Finishers multiverse. It's all of these characters from Metopia and more. And and, and we, there's Zach Lawley and Andrew Dong. And uh, they're going to be fighting. And the newest character, Papyrus, is just joining in. And they all fight while we bet with channel points. It's going to be crazy. Uh, plus, there may or may not be another secret fighter joining as well. We have to tune in. Yeah, Andrew will be there. I'll be there. Andrew will be there. Milky Chan will be there. Nagito's there. Papyrus, Sands, the whole game. All right, let's uh, hang out with some people. Um, we need more, like, hangout tickets, dude. There's, like, nothing to do. Uh, I guess Lincoln Midnight should go see a movie? No, fuck it. Mario and Marie are going to go see a movie. That sounds like fun. They're going to go watch the Mario movie. Papyrus will be there, and there will at least be one new character reveal. Maybe two, but mo at least one, 100%. Maybe two, but uh, for a million percent, a new character that you guys have never seen before uh, revealed. Papyrus was announced at the tournament, but there will be somebody else. There we go. Yeah, it's because she's not wearing, she doesn't, uh, doesn't have her hair done up. This is her day off. She's not a pop star, but she does her hair up when she goes out to party. But they're going to go to the movie. Because Mario and Marie kind of have, like, a crush on each other. So while they're in the city, they're going to go see a, a, gonna go see the Mario movie. See, now she looks cute. See, she did her hair up for her date with Mario. Now she 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 did her hair. Oh, God, dude. Look at all these, look at all these characters in the background. Is that Siva Gunner, dude? And Bon Bon and Choo Choo? <laughs> Mufasa? Oh no, Mamma Mia! <laughs> ah! How cute! Look at this. Please silence your cell phones and yourselves. 
That was so cute. Oh god, yeah, oh shit, they need to go see Morbius. They were so scared, they went to see Morbius and then they saw the part where we morbed and they freaked out, bro. What a nice date. Mario and Marie went to go see Morbius. That's the ultimate date. If you take somebody on a date to see Morbius, you guys will be lifelong partners. You guys will be soulmates. All right, uh, Milky Chan, I wish we had more dates. Where's all the, how do we get more date tickets, dude? How lame. Uh, well, I guess I'm gonna have uh, Link and Epona hang out. Just some bonding time with the horse, I suppose. If they don't leave you after seeing that shit, they love you exactly, Ludwig. Damn, well, somebody better mail me more date tickets, man. Before this playthrough ends, I want to I want to hang out with more people. But Link's going on a vision quest with a Pona. <gasps> is that is that Horror Tale Sands? What sounds good, Pona? Oh my God, it's Horror Tale Sands. That's fucked up. I didn't even know what they said because I was so distracted by Horror Tale Sands. Of course you love carrots. Aw, oh, Link bought a Pona some carrots. Nice. Alright, and then one more uh, outing. And it will be... You know what? I know we just went to the movie theater, but... Milky Chan and Bomb Drew Girl are gonna go see Morbius. So this is the headcanon. So Mario and, and uh, Marie just got back from, from seeing Morbius and then they were telling uh, Bomb Drew Girl and Bomb Drew Girl was like, hey Milky Chan, we gotta see this shit. We gotta see the part where he fucking goes morbid mode, dude. <laughs> when the doctor said that he was uh, morbidly a beast and he only had three weeks to live. So they're, they're gonna go see the movie too and see what they think of it. All right, they're gonna go see Morbius. Can't wait. An outing with the Bomb Chew Girl. Yeah, Bomb Chew Girl's like, I'm not so sure about this movie. I heard it's got really fucking bad reviews. <laughs> oh god, here we go. Holy shit, look at these characters. <gasps> it's spammed it in the crowd, dude! Um, Bomb Chew Girl's eating popcorn. Shh, Morbius is about to start. A Morbius sweep. Bob Two Girls just eating popcorn with her eyes closed. She doesn't give a fuck about the movie. Now is your chance to be a big shot. Ah, uh, the last kernel. That was fun. The tastiest movie ever. <laughs> Milky Joe's like, did you even watch it? She was just eating all of her popcorn. That's why I love the Bob Two Girl. They're thick as thieves. Damn, Bob Two Girl, you. Th That's what I said. How come when I uh called Bomb Chew Girl, when I said the Bomb Chew Girl was thick as a thief, she slapped me. The fuck? <laughs> but the funny thing is Bomb Chew Girl's not even thick, like canonically not. But you know what? She can be in her head if she wants to be. I'm not gonna say she can't. Damn, Spear of Gunir. All right, we've had enough dicking around. Let's actually just, uh, do some roulette, and then we'll uh, do the story. Oh, we can, we can actually get some XP. There's a good chance of getting a lot of XP. Usually it's a lot smaller than that, so hold up. Uh, Mario is the lowest level of everybody on the thing, so let's bust him up. I do want to see the new Doctor Strange movie, but I haven't seen it yet. But I like Doctor Strange, he's pretty cool. Let's go do more XP! Yeah, boy! We're grinding up! Poor people in level 13, I know, but we can't level up everybody. You know how long that would take? You know how long that would take to level up everybody, dude? I'm trying to make Milky Chan morbidly a beast. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny to me. 
Because there's just a the picture. It's just like a, a, a really, really fat guy. He's like, the doctor said I'm morbiously a beast. <laughs> and then I only have six months to live. Oh, that's just funny, dude. Let's keep rolling. Could you imagine if I get XP three times in a row? Nah, I knew it couldn't happen. What the hell is everything everywhere at once? What the heck is that? I didn't even heard of that movie. The last movie I saw was Sonic 2. It was like, follow me, and we'll escape from the city. Shining Daga. Who even gets that? That's like probably like a Jotaro weapon then. We, we haven't even used Jotaro in like, holy shit, that looks awesome. Holy cow, that looks so cool. What the hell? That is for Jotaro. Too bad we don't even use Jotaro. Good lord, man. JJK. I got. I have so much anime to watch. But coming back from the convention definitely like re-sparked my desire to watch a bunch of anime. So like, my love for anime has been reignited by the convention. No! Yes! Let's go, baby! More XP! It's a sad movie. Uh, Link. Let's level up Link. Look at all that XP, 24,000. We're gonna be rolling for a while. Everybody take a break. Let's just keep rolling while we got all these tickets, dude. Just keep rolling, 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 rolling. Rolling, 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 rolling. Ooh, a luxurious vacation. Do I have to use it now? Well, I guess Mario and Marie can go to Isle Delfino. Mamma mia! Let's go to Isle Delfino! I think Marie would like Isle Delfino. Seems like a Splatoon type world. Look at this! They're going to the island! It's the island from Isle Delfino! What's it, Pinna Park or whatever? Look at this vacation! Damn, son! Damn, dude, Mario looked like he got laid, bro. <laughs> he, he like crying and dancing. Ta-da! They level up a lot. You're right. Oh my god, I didn't even think about that. Uh, I didn't even think about that. All Mario Sunshine. The entire point of the game is to clean up ink, and Marie's a squid girl. How funny is that? How perfect is that? Resurgence? Gain the strength to get up if a friend falls in battle. That's like some anime shit right there, dude. Come on, I want one more royal portion of XP to give to Milky Chun. One more royal portion, come on. No, dude. We don't need another vacation. Squid Ink is a good ink? No, it is good, yeah! Squid Ink is good, because like... And this isn't even just me being a weirdo, because, like, they literally put it in boba. There's, uh, Italian dishes where they, like, dye some of the noodles with squid ink. It's very edible. That's why, like, every time, like, I eat squid ink, I just, like, close my eyes and, like, think in my head. I'm like, could you imagine if this was, like, Callie and Marie's ink? <laughs> and how much money I would pay for them to ink in my spaghetti? Think about that every time I eat spaghetti. Uh... I don't think Minna can go anywhere, so she's just gonna get rid of it, I guess. Oh, she's gonna sell it for money. I guess Milky Chan could have used it. Come on, one more royal portion. I like how every uh, Metopia episode just like deviates into me just like playing mini games for 50 hours. How many vacations can we go on, guys? We get it. Fine, fine, fine. We're gonna have Bomb True Girl and Milky Chan go on a vacation. They're also going to Isle Delphi. Damn, Milky Chun and Bomb True Girl really have just been copying Mario Marie the whole game. They're like, oh, they went to see Morbius? Let's go see Morbius. Oh, they went to Isle Delfino? Let's go to Isle Delfino. They really need to, like, come up with their own ideas for, like, hangouts. They're just, like, literally just copying everything that they're doing. I always thought that it would be amazing if there was a Splatoon mode where it was, like, five people play as Inklings and one person plays as Mario. 
and uh, like Mario gets flood and he gets like all the crazy nozzles and hover pack and the, the inklings have to ink more of the turf and Mario has to clean most of the turf. I've always thought that would be such a fun like crossover mode. But it didn't happen. Joined at the hip. Damn, dude. The closest we'll ever get to that is uh, Super Smash Bros, I guess. No, we were so close. I want one more Royal Portion of XP, please. One more. One more spin. One more spin. We're never going to have this chance to get that much XP. Like, this is a really good, like, a 1 in 4 chance is the highest we ever had. Usually it's, like, really small. I don't like this fucking... Whatever, I'm just going to keep giving them to Midna. You know what? Fuck it. This is not canon. They didn't actually go on a vacation twice. But this is just a really good way to get them to, like, level up. So, this is not canon. Not canon. They're just... I'm just going to level them up again. They didn't go on vacation two times. <laughs> just a way to boost their stats, you know? One more XP port and I'll be good. Yeah, they just stayed another day, dude. Shining Dagger, I'm fine with that because we can probably sell that for blow. How much money can we get from that shit? Holy shit! Yes, that's worth it! Oh my gosh! Yeah, that's like more than we can find in like any treasure chest in the whole game, so I'll take that. This is like the best like roll of all time. Sell it again. It's another 3,000 gold. <laughs> play again. No! No! I wanted to play again! Is it gonna change now? <gasps> Let's go! Never mind, we're good. I wanna roll two more times. I want one more portion of XP. Then I'll be off and I'll be done. One more portion of XP. Sure. It depends on the level that the inn was on. Ah, gotcha. Learn something new every day. <laughs> Mario's like spazoid now, dude. They're close. Hold up. We just uh... that way. If I get another ticket, I can have Link and Midna go on vacation. That's the whole reason I did this. Uh, I think we can get one more royal portion. I just want to get one more. One in four chance. Boo. It's not like I'm using these damn tickets anyway. We have like so many of them. Tim Rebs get mad. <laughs> oh! Let's go, baby! Let's go! That's what I'm talking about. Who gets it though? I think I'm gonna give it to Milky Chan. No, Bomb True Girl's falling behind. So I'm gonna give it to Bomb True Girl. Damn, Daniel. She's so cute. Right, this is the last roll for real. Last roll for real. I lied. One more, because that, I mean, that was a shitty one. One more roll. One more roll. This is it. This is it for real. This is it for real. Well, fuck. Just, a, just enough time for Lincoln Mid to go on vacation. <laughs> We're gonna go. Everybody's going on vacation today, I guess. I like how I said this wasn't gonna be a filler episode, and majority of, majority of it has been the characters going to see Morbius and the characters going on vacation. Damn, do they level up twice in a row? Likes a bit. 
One more. What? One more roll. It's not gonna kill anybody, dude. One more roll. One more roll. This is more XP than we're gonna get from, like, grinding every enemy in the game. Come on, I wanted a shining dagger. I'm sick of these vacation tickets, dude. Vacation schmation. Right, that's enough. That's enough. After this, we're, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're going and we're continuing the story. We gotta go back to talk to All Might, and maybe he knows where the last piece of the Master Emerald is. Oh god, I just remembered who knows where the last key is. It's fucking Bendy. Bendy's the one that knows where the last key is. Oh god. That was enough. That was a lot of XP. I can't be more greedy than that. So let's just move on. Let us move on with our lives. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Oi, Olomito! Looking for the jewels, are ya? What sort of jewels might those be? <laughs> jewels that look like eyes and nose and a mouth. Gee Willikers, that's creepy. I think all we need is another eye, right? I think we found one eye, a nose, and a mouth. Hi, Dr. Eggman. See, he looks better without the hair. A robot that has a face attached to it and moves? It's amazing. The invention of a lifetime. Oh, God. Yeah, we need that. We need the eye. And it's bendy, dude. Look at him. Oh, gosh. How mischievous. There's also Monokuma. Who's this fucking guy? Isn't that a guy from Danganronpa? Hello. The weather sure is beautiful today, isn't it? According to my fortune teller, tomorrow will be nice too. Yes. Wait, what was this one? Have a listen to this. I happen to have a mansion where a monster lives. Oh, hold up. And it's no ordinary monster. Okay, hold up. A ghost. Bendy wants us to build the ink machine? Well, chat, what if I told you that we're not going to talk to Bendy? What if we're going to do a side quest? But I have an idea of a lifetime, chat. You're not going to want to miss this. Hold up. I have an idea of a lifetime. We're going to take a break because we could level up. I have a good idea for this one. So ignore everything that this idiot said because I'm about to switch who this is. Give me one second. Let me, uh... It's not... Jar Jar Binks is not going to be in this game. That's stupid. But, uh... Would you guys like to take a break from trying to get all the keys and explore a haunted mansion? This will be a... I have a good idea for this. Oh boy. You guys want to see the Haunted Mansion episode? Alright, so I'm about to make up some new lore right now. Alright, we're going to make some headcanon lore right now. So, here we go. Ahem. After Milky-chan and the gang found the third key of chaos, they returned to the Traveler's Hub, very weary and tired. After many nights of partying and adventuring and seeing Morbius <laughs> and going on vacations, Milky-chan decided that she needed a rest. But when she fell asleep, something most peculiar happened. She woke up in the middle of the night to a figure standing at the edge of her bed. But 
Who was this mysterious figure? Milky-chan, a voice called out to her. That she did not recognize. Milky-chan, wake up. Wake up. We must defeat the ghost in the mansion. Who are you? says Milky-chan. Why, I think you know me very well. For I am Father Benedict. <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, no, sorry. He's here. Have a listen to this, Milky Chan. I happen to have a mansion where a monster lives. Milky Chan, wake up. We must defeat the monster. It's no ordinary monster. Oh, no. It's a ghost. Isn't it so scary? And so I have a favor to ask of you. Can you drive the ghost from the mansion? Let's do it! So, AI dungeon has become real. <laughs> AI dungeon has become real. Yeah, what if the ghost was a black dragon? Oh my god. So, um, AI dungeon has now become real. Remember how Milky Chan was in a guild and she woke up and she like woke up at an inn. She was asleep at an inn and then somebody was at the foot of her bed. Well, that's what happened in Metopia. She was sleeping at the inn and she woke up to Father Benedict asking her and telling her that she must defeat the dragon. This might be a side quest, but this is going to be one hell of a quest. So let us drive out the ghostly dragon. Let's go, dude. Father Benedict showed up. Damn. Coming with you. Wow, AI Dungeon the game is now real. Who would have look at him! Look at the way he floats! Holy shit, he's like Doctor Strange, bro! <laughs> new lore! New lore! Holy shit, he floats! Didn't he float in the story too? Didn't it say like Father Benedict like hovered above the bed or some shit? Oh hell no. Nah. <laughs> oh god, this is gonna be one hell of a fucking episode now. He only floats if you walk, bro. Goodbye, Bendy. It looks like something Father Benedict would do. Well, here we go. We've seen more- I know you guys were like, it's been a while since we've seen Father Benedict lore. Well, here we go. Actually, before that, we should say hi to somebody in particular. Do you guys want to say hi to somebody that we saw? Oh my god, it's the dragon. <laughs> Except he's white instead of black. <laughs> Milky Chan, we must see the dragon. God, this really is like the Milky Finishers anime. Holy shit. I like how Father Benedict is with us even here. Oh, hey, hey, hey guys. It's been about a week. How was it? And they're, they're back from the Pop Team Invitational. It's Papuko and Pippi Me. <laughs> back from the Pop Team Invitational. Yeah, we get it. A bunch of charlatans. They always fuck up everything. We just had to say hi to them. They're not saying anything new. We'll give them. No, we're not spending that much on them. Alright, see you guys later. Dear God. Traveling with Father Benedict is the most cursing. Hey, it's Andrew and Freddy. Do you ever listen to what I, word I said, superstar? <laughs> give me a fucking break, man. I fucking hate fighting to Freddy. I said the Dark Lord scuttled off to eat somewhere. Oh, that's so? You just don't care about any of this. <laughs> what do you want me to do about it? Andrew Dong and Freddy. What's up, Ganon? What's up, Anka? We're traveling with our new buddy, Father Benedict. <laughs> well, I already know a perfect thumbnail idea for this video. I can't believe that something that was made up by an AI is, like, now real. An AI made this up, and now literally Milky Chan and Father Benedict are hanging out. Wait, how the hell did I get out of here? This is not where I need to be. Wait, how, how the... Where the fuck I go? Oh, we need to go to the dragon. Just like Father Benedict said. He, he predicted this. Dude, I'm going all the wrong damn way. Right. 
This is not where we need to go. This is where we need to go. This is where we met Myth. Myth was lived in this area. Oh, dear God. Oh, shit, remember when we were hanging out with Myth, we saw that mansion? And we thought that we were going to go to the Haunted Mansion with Myth, but we're actually going to the Haunted Mansion with Father Benedict? That's actually a lot more fitting. It's actually a lot more fitting that we go with Father Benedict, because he's creepy as shit. Oh, God, I forgot my way there. What? Where the hell am I? We're going through portals? This really is like AI dungeon. Remember when like Milky Child would like wake up and she'd be somewhere else, dude? We gotta do another AI dungeon episode. The only bad thing is that AI dungeon costs money. But uh, hey, if we get if we hit 64 subs, I will buy AI dungeon for a month and we'll do an AI dungeon new episode. How the fuck do I get to the mansion, bro? I'm lost. Is this the way? Let's go, first try. All right, what could go wrong? Oh my God, this looks horrible idea already. This already looks like the worst. No, I had to buy it last time, but I only paid for a month because you can you can buy just a month because it's, it's a monthly subscription. It's not like you just buy it once. So I paid for it for a month, did two streams of it, and then it's ran out since. So yeah, it's a monthly subscription. I usually just subscribe to it for $10 and then cancel my sub and then in a couple months when chat wants me to do it again I did it I do it again because <laughs> I don't use it that often to do it every single month the mana macabre <laughs> new lore this is father benedict's house oh this is perfect look at him float I want to make others laugh Dude, Father Benedict's lore is happening in this episode. Oh dear God, you know the rules, Chet. Top, middle, or bottom. What's up, Griffin? Top, middle, or bottom. Dude, this music is amazing. Nice, Taters. That's cool. I can't wait to start playing the game. Middle? All right. I just do the first option. Oh, I love this. This is the best side quest yet. It's literally a haunted mansion with Father Benedict. How do you get better than this shit? Nice. We got a frozen meal. We got... Knowing that the mouse one day might leave its hole to get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Dude, this music is really good. I need some cold water. You okay, Mario? All right, chat. Top or bottom? There's a lot of... We're going to be lost in this mansion all episode, I think. Top or bottom? Top or bottom? All right. If you guys get me lost, I'm blaming you. I like the green lighting. It just looks really creepy. We're on, we're on the move. I get into the groove. We're as free as the wind. We're as free as Aaron Yeager. Where's Aaron in the... Oh. Hey, kid. Well, hey, Link, one of a bad time, pal. Buddy old chum, pal. Uh, th this time I'll pick. Uh, look to the right. Oof. He tripped on a candy. <laughs> Sand has COVID, you're right. <gasps> Father Bennett is like, is Bomb Chew Girl famous? Not really, but in our in our channel she is, but in the rest of the world nobody knows who the fuck she is. Oh god, what is this? Okay. In fact, Bomb True Girl is probably the least famous. Well, okay, technically Milky Chan's the least famous, but she's way less famous than Mario Link. But on our channel, on the Milky Finisher, she's a popular character. Oh, holy shit, dude. We get to see Father Benedict fight, bro? Dang, also Milky Chan got fricked up. No way. More people know who Opponent is than the Bomb Chew Girl. I 
I love this area that we're in, though. I didn't know that this side quest was gonna be this sick. Hey, whoa, 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 Link! Better back away from my girl, dude. You got enough. Link has enough girls. Father better was he throwing like a fish? That was weird. So yeah. don't worry guys. Uh, like I said, I'm working on the lore video, the Milky Finishers movie, that'll explain all the lore. Uh, and then soon as I'm done with that. I will try to get a release date for uh, Invitational 4, which will be the real final battle. Papako and PP Me destroyed the stream, so we got tricked last time. Just a bomb trooper. I just love how he floats. That is so perfect. I don't like the skeleton with the legs. The skeletons. Um, I just remember the video Marco made. Maybe in a little bit I'll play the ending of that. When Milky Chan like woke up to Father Benedict. If you guys don't know where the Father Benedict meme comes from, there's a video on the Milky Archives called Father Benedict Origin. And that video explains his origin story. If you are not familiar with who this character is. But Chet seems to love him. You're right, I did say skeleton and not papyrus. Wow! Wow, we talk about <laughs> Wow! We start talking about papyrus and suddenly Sanchez is like, I'm all better, guys. <laughs> yeah, okay, asshole. Wow, how fitting. We The first time I, I, I just say Papyrus and Sands like, I'm better now, guys. That's funny. Holy shit. Aw, oh, they're cozy together. I like how there's an inn inside the mansion. That's bullshit. How is there a, an, an inn inside the mansion? That's so hard to say. What a sentence. There is an inn inside the mansion. Gosh. There's a tongue twister, bro. Yo, what's up, Icy? What's going on, dude? We're playing some more Milky Metopia. We can look at all these characters. Man, we got Jotaro here. We got Link, Mario. Hold up, Link wants, ooh. Everybody wants new armor, what the hell? That is really fucking cute looking armor. Everybody wants new shit. I do like our Milky Chan emote, but it doesn't show up the best. So maybe I might have to replace it. That looks like donkey shit. Um, I might have to replace it, but it maybe it looks fine. Do you guys like it? It's a it's a free emote. If it was a sub emote, I'd be more critical, but it's a free emote. I think Milky Chan emote's fine. Oh, God, they haven't eaten dinner yet. Every time they eat dinner, I get hungry in real life. They can eat next time. They'll, they'll eat next time. Bomb True Girl. That's a pretty... Damn, 143 defense. No, Bomb True Girl bought a banana instead, you doofy girl. Damn, Dayrod just banned Retro Ruler. What did Retro Ruler ever do to you, man? Did he beat you in the tournament? Is that what happened? He beat you in the tournament? Yeah, it bites the dust his ass. Dark Milky Chan armor. Looking kind of fresh on her, but no. I like what we got. Thank God Charlations isn't here, else she would be very upset that I'm not changing Milky Chan's clothes, but she's fine. <laughs> it's fine, she's fine the way she is. 
And with that, I think we're good. We spent, oh my god, we almost spent all of our damn gold. They'll eat next time. They're not hungry right now. They'll eat the next time they go to sleep. They don't need to eat if they're technically in the dream world where Father Benedict resides. Is this a dream or is it reality? Shirtless Mario Troop. Deeper into Father Benedict's mansion we go. Milky Chan, we must stop the dragon. Oh god, what else happened in that story? Wasn't Papyrus in that story too? Oh yeah, and Gaster and shit? Gaster and Papyrus were in the story? Whoa, that looks sick, actually. Uh-oh, am I actually gonna have to switch this? That actually looks fucking awesome. That actually looks ridiculous. She looks like Zero Wally at Milky Chan, dude. It's literally like, it's literally Zero Wally at Milky Chan. That looks really good. I'm gonna keep the blue shirt, though. What do you guys say, blue or white? Blue or white? Which one do you think looks better? I'm not a, I'm not gonna pick any other color. Blue or white are the only two options. Blue? Yeah, I think so too. I think, yeah, cool. We're all in the green. We're, we're all in the green suite. Yeah, that I, I couldn't say no to that, dude. How could I say no to this outfit? She looks so good, dude. She actually looks like the hero of light now. She looks ridiculously powerful. Oh god, Dirt Titan and Jotaro are talking. We got a lot of time on our hands today, since Milky Chan never takes us out adventuring anymore. <laughs> time for a new look. Oh no. Oh no. No Dark Titan. He's gonna put on an anime. He's gonna put on a cosplay. No, don't do it. Don't do it. No! No! <laughs> he looks so stupid! <laughs> Oh my god, dude. Dark Titan cosplay. Was he cosplay as a Danganronpa character? <laughs> oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. No. It's so bad. What's going on? This is a video game, but it's also a playthrough. Welcome. Um, this playthrough might not make a lot of sense to new viewers, but uh, here on the Milky Finishers, our channel has a lot of lore. And this is kind of like our channel's anime. It's all of the characters from our entire, uh, all the games that we stream all hanging around together because we have an anime girl mascot named Milky Chan. And this is her story as she meets a bunch of characters from anime and video games, Link, Mario, Sans from Undertale. So, uh, feel free to have a good time. If you ever want to start from episode one to catch up on the story, you can, uh, Watch episode one. It's on our YouTube channel. It's on our second YouTube channel. But yeah, look, we got Lincoln Midna, Mario, Marie from Splatoon, Sans, Chaos Chan, the Dark Titan, Jotaro. That's our channel mascot, Milky Chan, and the Bomb Chew Girl from The Legend of Zelda. But welcome. My name is Zach Lolly, and I hope that you enjoy yourself on the stream. We mostly stream Mario and Zelda games. But this playthrough is kind of like our channel's anime. Oh dear god, what is this? Is this the end already? Wow, we made it through the mansion quick, bro. Watch, this is gonna be like the hardest boss of all. Wait, are we, act are we gonna have to fight Father Benedict? Dude, imagine if we have to fight Father Benedict, dude. What the fuck is this, dude? Holy shit! Bro, who the fuck just donated a hundred fucking dollars? Who the fuck just donated a hundred dollars, you fucking asshole? Bro! <laughs> Saints fan? fan here. Holy shit, dude, thank you! If you're a fan of Sands, you should have donated to Sands, not me! That should have been Zach fan. Holy fuck. Was there a song attached to that? Dude, what the hell? Thank you so much. Who the hell? There wasn't even a song attached. Let's just play that one more time. 
Uh, yeah, we gotta play it one more fucking time, dude. Talk about dude. That's what I'm talking about. Big S A H N S fan here. Arigato gozaimasu. Holy shit, man! <clears throat> Thank you so much, Sans fan, for the 100, dude. Ah. <clears throat> uh. My birthday was just a few days ago, and and uh, my birthday was just a few days ago, and I, I went to an anime convention, and I spent way too much money, and well, now I now we have enough for AI Dungeon, dude. I'm getting AI Dungeon for Sunday stream. Fuck this. I'm I'm uh, I'm I'm gonna get AI Dungeon the special edition, and we're gonna do another AI Dungeon episode. Now nah, I'll, I'll I'll get it for for next Sunday stream. Holy shit. Thank you so much. I don't even know what to say. Uh, holy fuck. That's insane. Wow. Uh, yeah. All right, well, let's keep playing the game, I guess. Damn, dude. Where the hell's my remote? <laughs> I don't even know. Where did I put my... There it is. There it is. Holy shit. For... I didn't expect that during a Metopia stream. That's for sure. Well... I always tell you guys I try to take all your guys' support and donations and put it into the channel. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna get the special edition of AI Dungeon. We're gonna do a crazy AI Dungeon stream, and uh, yeah. Now we're uh, we're halfway to the naked Aaron Yeager figure fund. And I'm kidding. <laughs> now we're halfway to our goal of Aaron Yeager figure unboxing. <laughs> mm. Dude, Father Benedict is based... No, that was Sans fan, dude. Wow, well, uh... Thank you so much. That was, uh, insanely generous. And kind. And, uh... I really don't even know what to say. Uh, just other than the fact that, like... Uh, I know my stream isn't the most popular. And I don't get, the, like, the most viewers or whatever. But, um, the fact that you guys support me is, is why I can keep doing this, you know? Uh, even when I have a lot of bills or, you know, gas prices go up or I got to worry about this or that, uh, it's nice that I can still stream and I can do 12 hour marathons and I can keep going because you guys support me so much. So thank you. That's, uh, I would never, ever be able to do it this long without you guys. So the whole reason that I'm still streaming to this day is because of people like you guys. So thank you. Uh, and let's continue on with the story. Jeez, I was I was talking about the Father Benedict boss fight, and I forgot like what the hell I was even doing. Uh, anyways, I gotta get my composure back. Holy shit! Link's looking for gold. Uh oh. Honey, who the hell is this? It looks like a Rayman villain. That's the ghost. That's it. Father Benedict. What is this? What's this? Is this weird? I didn't expect this. Who's this new character in the lore? Hattie? Alright, sorry. Back to the, uh... <laughs> back to the story. Uh, it's the ghost. I feel like we should have explored more of the mansion before we did this. Just to hang out with Father Benedict some more, but whatever. Have at you! Well, here we go. What is this? Pop up puppet? Did somebody say puppet? <laughs> <laughs> Pop up puppet, bro? Alright. Whoop his ass. Yeah, what is the fake enemy? This is a very mysterious enemy. <laughs> I think you beat him in the tournament, dude. They hate you because you're the champ. Wait, I just looked at... Holy shit, I looked at Chad Mario's already dead? Holy hell. I thought we were going to have to fight Father Benedict, but we're fighting alongside Father Benedict. This is a plot twist.
kindred spirits. Give Mario some meth, he's dead, bro. Dude, Link is pissed that Mario fell down. Dude, Milky Chan looks so stylish. If you don't remember, it's kind of more hilarious. Wait, Retro doesn't... I don't even remember why Dayron is mad at Retro. Wait, we killed him that fast? What the hell? This is weird. This, this can't be right. This can't be right. That's gotta be a fake... A fake out. There's no way that the boss fights over. The Puppet Peppa. Great puppet. <laughs> Father Benedict, that was way too scary. But you got the mansion back for me. Hmm, I think, yes. Take this. Wait, was that really it? What the hell? Father Benedict's story is weird, dude. It's been in the family for years, but you should have it. The bat charm. Hmm. Well, goodbye then. That, that was actually it. That was very, very strange. But like, it, it was just it was just a weird hat ghost. It wasn't even scary at all. Wow, well on, uh, on that note, I guess that finishes Father Benedict's quest. <laughs> Maybe we will see him again in the future. Whether it's in Metopia or... Somewhere else. Whoa! It's no- Oh god, it's not over yet! Whoa, wait, what is this? The, the thing Father Benedict gave us is- <gasps> Vampire? You can now do the vampire job? Wait, what? What? Is it a curse? It seems a new power has awoken. You can now try the vampire job. You can wield the fearsome power of the undead. Oh, hell no. Don't do it, Milky Chan. You have now access to the vampire job class. You can choose jobs via the party section of the menu. What are you waiting for? Why is Bomb True Girl looking for Mario? That's the most random shit. Have they ever even had a discussion together? Um. Wait, was Midna not? No, yeah, Midna's an imp. You know what, chat? I have a perfect idea for this. Um. Since the Dark Titan was pretty much just a, a weaker link, what would you guys think about making the Dark Titan a vampire? Giving him dark abilities, because he's the Dark Titan. Because Dark Titan is just pretty much Link. He's just a warrior. He just fights with a sword. Do you guys think we should make Dark Titan the vampire? I don't think anybody else would make sense. If only we had Dio! Oh my god, I just thought about that. What if we had Dio? Oh shit, the Dio and Jotaro. Uh, but we don't have Dio, he's not here. Alright, I think we're gonna we're gonna give uh, the Dark Titan vampire abilities and then we should uh, take him out into the field. But first things first. Um, let's see what these want. These, these two want. Maybe Bomb True Girl is something she wants to say. Wait, are they fighting? That's weird. Okay, let's listen to this conversation. Mario. I'm sorry for being so mean. When, when were they ever mean? When were they mean to each other? I don't even remember. It is okay, Bomb Girl. We can all be friends. Aw, that's cute. I didn't even know that they were like friends. I had no idea. That's, that's sure. Bomb True Girl's forgiven. Who, could, who couldn't forgive her? I don't remember them ever being uh, angry. But sure, that's fine. 
All right, where's the party? Uh, all right, so this is this is new lore. The Dark Titan is getting powers from Father Benedict. Fine, I'll do it myself. His favorite food is tornado lemonade. I didn't know that. It wouldn't make sense for Milky Chan to be a vampire because she's supposed to be like the hero. She's supposed to be pure and like light. But Dark Titan is kind of evil, even though he's like working with them to stop Ouija, the greater evil. That outfit looks like shit. We're going to have to change the outfit. But other than that, <laughs> other than that, We'll change his outfit back. Give me a second. Details? Alright, let's, uh... Let's change his clothes, because that looks... He looks like a fucking kindergartner magician. No hat. Ball. <laughs> oh god, this is so cursed. Look at this shit. Perfect. There we go. Now he's back. I just want to. See. Yeah, this is all really. Oh my. <laughs> all right. All right, we're good. This is good enough. Perfect. All right, I'm actually gonna take him out into the field just because I want to see what his attacks do. Uh, I guess I'll give them food. I guess I'll give them food. They haven't eaten all freaking stream. Uh, Hell dog. Have you ever seen a three-headed hell dog fight itself over for a hot dog? I have. Uh, Milky Chan, do you like hot dogs? What? You don't like hot dogs, Milky Chan? They can be good. Uh, I think Link would like turkey curry. Dude, nobody likes any of the shit I'm giving them. Never mind, they all hate this shit. I'm saving the concentrated light for, like, the final battle. I'm gonna have Milky Chan eat the concentrated light and something nuts is gonna happen. So we're saving that for a very important story. <gasps> That's so cute, the doggy donut. Warm and gentle, just like a dog. Smells a lot better though. Bomb Chew Girl needs the doggy donut. She loves it. This is like something that I get at the Japanese thing. At the Japanese uh, fest, they have like really cute pastries. She loves it. She loves it. She like saw the light of heaven. Um, Mario looks like a TV dinner guy. He's just gonna get like a microwavable dinner. And he's gonna get two because it wasn't enough for a growing man. And, uh, didn't it say that the Dark Titan's favorite thing was... That makes sense because Andrew's like alcoholic, so he loves his, he loves his alcoholic drinks. <laughs> he's really weak now, though. I'll give him another one. Yeah, he's like, more, more. Now we're getting behind the wheel now. Right. Damn, Mom Chew Girl's still hungry. I'll give her this. All right. Uh, all right, let's actually take... Um, I'm going to let... Bomb True Girl have a tiny bit of a rest. And, oh god, he's level one. I just want to take Dark Titan out to see. I just want to see these new abilities in action. That's all. I just want to see what these new abilities are like. Bomb True Girl's just taking a rest day. Go back in the mansion. Retro Ruler, why are you crying, dude? It's just, it's just uh, bites the dust. Anybody can do it on anybody. It's only ten minutes. Ten minutes is like nothing, dude. <gasps> what the mansion's gone? Oh, we can't explore the mansion anymore. Boo. Oh, that sucks. Oh, well. Father Benedict. So it makes this is the question. It's like, 
Was it all just a dream? Or was it real? So that now that oh god. You're so kind, Mario. Am I? You let monsters get away. Uh, the, just, just the weaker ones. The ones that they come looking for a fight. I don't let them off so lightly. After all, I can't let them hurt my friends. Wait, is there something in Milky Chan's pocket? Oh, there's a banana. Yeah, Ludwig gets banned like fucking 20 hours. Oh, oh it's a... Uh, it's uh, from Marie. Dear Milky Chan, boo, did I scare you? Here's a little pick-me-up from Marie. Marie's so thoughtful. She's like the older sister of the group. She looks out for everybody. Ludwig got banned for like six hours in one stream. <laughs> Wow. You just gotta save up channel points and ban them back, dude. That's how the milky finishers roll. In this world, it's ban or be banned. Why does it always show these two? Okay. Uh oh. Rebs, Reb, cover your eyes. I don't know if you're gonna like what they're talking about. <laughs> Reb's gonna cover her eyes for this cutscene. <gasps> Tell me the name of the person you like. I don't like anyone. I do. That's nice. At least pretend to be interested. Hmm. Mm. I don't know. That was that was ambiguous. That was very very ambiguous. That was a good that was a good moment. I I enjoyed that. I just want to see Dark Titan fight a guy. I don't know here. What the hell is this? What the shit? Running all over the planet. Is this Ouija's castle again? No, I don't want to be here. Bro, we were in Ouija's castle. This is the last place my ass wants to be. We spent like, we spent like four streams in this place. Oh god, now the Dark Titan floats like Father Benedict. That's so cursed. I didn't even notice that. Now the Dark Titan hovers like Father Benedict, bruh. Uh-oh. Welcome to the underground. Link just fell into the hole. Where he goes, nobody knows. Link! Sans? Sans, wake up! Well, what is it, dude? A human has... <laughs> Sorry, alright. <laughs> we'll see you in the, under, see in the above ground. <laughs> well, now we don't have Link and the Dark Titan's level one. I like how when I act there, I was gonna say, when I actually want to fight a guy, nobody shows up. I just want to see the Dark Titan fight. Oh, not nah, these guys, dude. These guys killing one hit. Are you shitting me? Wow, yeah, that was sexy. Wow, well, I'm never gonna get to see Dark Titan fight. Mario's like, holy shit, I'm gonna buy myself. Wow, that was the most bull. Those enemies are bullshit, dude. Nice, they just go bump, 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 to smoke us. You win some, you lose some. That was a oof moment. Dude, I just wanted to see the Dark Titan fight, dickheads. Hey, 
Well, I guess that's too much to ask for in this hell on earth. I know, they're like ridiculously strong. And if only I could like do the shield before they did that, you know? Now that we have Link, I can probably kill them. Because I could just revive them and give Mario some methamphetamines. Run, run, run! There we go. Alright. Revenge time? Alright, hold up. Can I, can I block their shit? Sprinkles! Yes! Oh! See, if you're fast enough, you can sprinkle them. Sweet. I'll protect the... Yeah, fine. I'll protect these... The reason I'm not protecting Mario is because if Dark Titan gets knocked out, I can't see him fight. So, Mario's gonna have to be the, the guinea pig here. So, yeah, if you're quick enough, you can use the shield to block their abilities. That is very useful. Wow, they just double team Milky Charm. Doesn't matter if she's dead anyway. Come on, Link. Avenger. Now, Dark Titan, I want to oh, yeah, see how he fights. That wasn't very exciting. He really just threw a boomerang bat. Was he just Batman? Sweet. Da -da -da -da. Remember, it feels like years ago. Remember when Milky Chan was a. Uh, a cat girl, and then she trained with the Sheikah, and she was wearing the Sheikah outfit in the desert. That feels like so long ago, dude. That was a whole, that was a different season. Stabbed him in the sheen. You know what he did? He kicked him in the penis. <laughs> Holy shit, that levels him up quick. Dark Titan leveled up. Ooh, yummy. You guys are still hungry. What the heck? That's random. Kimono? Mario in a kimono. That's something I never thought I'd see. Damn, he kind of be looking nice in that red one, though. But no. <laughs> he do. He do be looking pretty nice. Whoop, 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 whoop. Everybody's such good friends. Alright, well, it was fun using the Dark Titan for a few seconds, but I think we're switching back to the Bomb 2 Girl. If we ever need a vampire, we can just hit him up again. The Bomb 2 Girl's just way stronger and way better. And look at everybody's, like, relationship status. The, the weakest relationship is Mario and Bomb 2 Girl. Maybe they should hang out more. Not, maybe not be best friends or obviously not, like, romantically interested. But, like, they, they should get more acquainted if they're constantly hanging out. Other than that, though, like, everybody's, like, really close-knit in this group. Except for Mario and Bomb 2. So, we'll maybe have them hang out. Just to, like, you know, just get, like, some coffee. If I if only had some more cafe tickets, you know? That'd be a perfect one. Go to, like, the cafe together, get, like, a, some hot chocolate and shit. But either way, it's time for the story quest again. Unless we see another side quest that sounds awesome. If we see another side quest that sounds awesome, we'll take another detour. But I think we're gonna talk to Bendy, finally. Hey, at least Father Benedict got a cameo, right? Who's this? Who are you? I guess we could talk to more cool. Oh god, he's bad. He's still here. <laughs> now I can sleep like a baby. They don't make coffins soundproof, you know. Who the fuck? Some weird ass people. Alright. We woke up. Yeah, you're right. Sleep again. Yeah, wake up. I hold who is this? Who are you? Cherry? The sporty chef. I'm a traveling chef. I must find all of the delicious things in the world and eat them. Who the heck? Okay, whatever. Alright, it's Bendy time. 
do you think you could help me? See, I don't know anything about Bendy, so you guys are gonna have to tell me. Oh God, his friend Waluigi. Okay, this is already way off the rails. I picked up this weird jewel. That actually fits because Waluigi and Wario are jewel thieves, so it's so funny that he would pick up a cursed jewel. And then it happened. This giant monster swooped out of nowhere and flew off with him. I was so terrified that I ran off. But now I feel dreadful. Can you help me rescue Waluigi? I think chat's gonna love this. Bendy and the Ink Machine to rescue Waluigi. I can never think of Bendy and the Ink Machine without thinking about that kid that sang and danced the song in front of his classmates and it was the most cringe thing I have probably ever saw in my life. I wonder if I can find it. Wait, actually, hold up. I forgot to play the Father Benedict ending. How could I forget, since we saw him? Who would have thought when we played AI Dungeon that he would, uh, become canon in the Metopia verse? He wouldn't let you show him? Damn, dude. Oh, here we go, here we go. This is not the- this is the Father Benedict story. So if you guys ever want to watch this, if you guys ever want to find out who Father Benedict is, there's a 30 minute video on our YouTube channel about how Father Benedict became real. If you sit in your swamp hut, mixing a magical potion, you hear a knock at the door. I can't believe he actually became real. Job. He says, I am Father Benedict. Let's just skip the to the ending. of the Catholic Church. I need to talk to you about the Black Dragon. Oh, God. There he is, dude. There he is. I just got to play the ending. He takes off his mask. The ultimate streamer, Milky Chan. You know about me? Know about you. Fun. <laughs> this dude's nuts. How <laughs> <My> normal <laughs> Amazing. It's one of the most incredible videos. Oh, here we go. <laughs> incredible. <laughs> yeah, dude. So, that was later retcons to just be another dream, though, sadly. So, we still don't know everything about Father Benedict. So, even that good ending was just another dream. If you don't understand, you'll have to watch the full video, but pretty much Milky-chan got caught in a dream loop where she kept waking up and waking up and she couldn't escape from a dream within a dream. And that ended up just being another dream, so. Father Benedict, we still don't know his true identity or when he will strike again. But we, we just know that uh, he appears in dreams. That's his lore, is he appears in people's dreams. Alright, let's go save Waluigi. Bendy. But you didn't have to cut me off. I think the thing flew off to the powdered peaks. Please save my friend. All right, Bendy. Are you coming with me or what's up? Oh, he's not coming with us. We just have to go on our own. Oh, never mind. Oh. I'm watching you, buddy. But you didn't have to cut me off. So, uh, Bendy's not coming with us, which is kind of, oh God, it's Papyrus. <laughs> no, I thought we could go one street without talking to Papyrus. Well, 
Well, into another cave we go. This place looks pretty. What? Damn, they almost got killed! Well, that's the end of, uh... Milky Metopia. That was the season finale. They all got crushed to death. The end. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Where did everyone go? Well, nothing for it but to keep going. Keep moving forward. Wow! That was so funny. I just talked about how Mario and Bomb Chew Girl need to be more acquainted, and now they're forced to be together because they, they just got separated. That is hilarious. So now Milky Chan and uh, Link are together, and Mario and Bomb Chew Girl gotta hang out. That's forced character development right there. Oh, wait, duh. Wait a second. I'm not leaving with two. Uh, well, it's a good excuse to use, uh, Marie and Dark Titan again. Uh, what? Bro, my game just cr how much progress did I lose? What? Father Benedict? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? My game just crashed. How much progress did I lose? It was all a dream, and Father Benedict... Okay, we didn't lose jack shit. We're fine. We're still in this area. Okay, we, we literally, like, lost no progress. <laughs> that was very weird. Okay, you know what? I think I'm gonna take Jotaro instead of... The Dark Titan. <laughs> that was the false timeline. The Dark Titan wa- New lore, chat. The Dark Titan didn't want to go adventuring that day, so he went back in time to prevent himself from going on this quest. <laughs> That's what he did, because the Dark Titan can go back in time. So the Dark Titan went back in time to prevent himself from going, because he was, he was lazy. Mario's on that side. Wow, the lore is really getting crazy. <laughs> the, the, the lore is really getting nuts in this episode. Shit. Just wait till uh, Milk Caliber, which chronologically takes place at the end of this game. Aw, Milky Chan's tummy hurts. <laughs> wow, Marie's just like, that's nice. Yeah, we're cool. All right, chat, you know the rules. Top or bottom, where are we going? Up or down, up or down, top or bottom. First one I see, I'll do. Oh, you got it. Can I take a nap? I forgot that Jotaro walks like a cringe lord. It's the Icy Maidens. Well, after we get this last key, that's pretty much probably going to be it. And then it's going to be like the final battle again. So I'm glad we did some side quests. But. Aw, oh, Marie, we missed you. We haven't had Marie and Jotaro for a while. They're still hanging in there. They're not like super weak or anything. That's not Jotaro's catchphrase. Got him? What the hell? He's supposed to say yada yada does it. He doesn't say got him. So came in the mail today. Marie's so cute. Can't believe Callie never made a cameo though. Characters that I'm surprised we never made a cameo is. Wait, what is, oh, what is this? Dirt? Uh, Princess Peach never showed up. Luigi never showed up. And, uh, poor Luigi. And Callie. Let's dig it up. 
don't think we're missing anybody else while they're all just watching Milky Chan dig. Oh, there's nothing? I don't think we really missed any Milky Finisher characters. Don't never give up, Milky Chan. Keep going! Never give up. They're all sleeping. <sighs> nice! See? Determination pays off! shit. That is true, Reb. Marie's going to look for Mario. She's worried about him. She's like, what do you mean Mario got separated? I'll look for him. You know what to do, Chet. Top or bottom? Where are we going? Down? You got it. Link is, Link is singing. Smokes, dude. Two snowmen block the path. Uh, let's give him the green milk. I just love how there's like an actual milk weapon. Isn't that perfect? Even if it is just baby milk, that's so perfect for Milky Chan. Yada yada. He said it. There, he actually said the thing. Yada yada does it. That is the cutest freaking mug I've ever seen in my life. I want one of those in real life to drink hot cocoa out of. Still no luck trying to find Mario and Bombchu Girl. Day three. Mario and Bombchu Girl are nowhere to be found. We hope that they are still alive. Well, honestly, while everybody's separated, it does kind of... Because Midna's not here either. Uh, I mean, might as well have Milky Chan room with Link while all this is going on. And opponent wants to see uh, Marie anyways, so... Ta-da! <laughs> Ta, Marie. Cute. Link, don't waste time. Man, this guy is something else. Twilight Princess Link, man. I'm, I'm looking at him in a new light after this game. Alright, let's continue our search. For Mario and Bomb 2 Girl. These are our friends. Oh boy. Just one second, guy. I'm replying to something. Okay, continuing the This is a really... I love this area. Don't judge, he's high. Yeah, you're right. You're right, Reb. Okay, well, no, I take that back. Okay, no, I actually take that back. If I was, like, in a committed relationship with, like, somebody like Midna, then no. But if I was if I was single, then yeah. But, you know, that's, that's different. I wonder how everyone's been doing. Oh, we're actually about to see. Meanwhile. Well, uh, we can't just hang around. Let's uh, keep going. This is the craziest. The plot twist is that this is actually just the craziest Mario 64 ROM hack ever made. <laughs> I want to go to Chaos Chan's room. Yeah, we haven't seen Chaos Chan in a while. What the hell? This is like the weirdest pairing ever. This is all so freaking weird. Sans is by himself in the stables. <laughs> and Bob Drew Girl Chaos Chan. Aw. What a cute singing voice. Great set of lungs. I kind of feel a little bit bad for Chaos Chan. Because Chaos Chun and Milky Chun used to be, like, really close until the Bomb True Girl showed up. And I feel like Bomb True Girl became, like, the new best friend. But 
It's fine. Chaos Chan is like an ethereal being, so she doesn't really think of things like friendship and jealousy. She's too busy, like, controlling chaos and the unfathomable density of the spiritual realm, so we're fine. They can be friends, too, in the meantime. Actually... No, I want Mario and Mom True Girl to be friends. Because they hang out a lot, and they, they should get to know each other a little bit. Uh, well, Chaos Chan will join, and... Midna will join, I guess. Who do you guys want more, Midna or Sans? Who do you guys want more? We have so much fan art for Sunday, I can't wait. It's gonna be like the biggest fan art segment ever. You want Sans instead? Okay. Fine, we'll bring him. We haven't brought Sans anywhere in like five billion years, so. That is so cute, Reb. That is so cute. They're watching Morbius. <laughs> Dude, that's a that's the most more billion freaking. Wow, we're actually playing as Mario. Guys, we're playing Mario 54 again! Woohoo! <laughs> Wow, look at this clusterfuck of a gang. We have... Dude, why is everybody talking about being free? This is so weird. We have Bomb True Girl, Sans, Mario, and Chaos Chan. Top or bottom? Top or bottom? This is, a, this is not a group I ever thought would hang out. Oh, alright. I'm getting a blisters. They're free from Father Benedict, yeah. True. I feel like a lot happened in this episode. This was definitely a very fulfilling episode. Hey yo, nice cast, John, buddy old pal. Luckily, Bomb True Girl and, and Mario are, like, ridiculously strong. They could probably... I just forgot that Cash had a big wad of cash that she slaps people with. Bruh. She just used, like, a big wad of money. Snow milk. Me too. This playthrough is amazing. This will go down in history as one of my favorite playthroughs. You guys should watch it from episode one if you guys want to. On the Milky Archives. The Milky Archives is our second YouTube channel uh, where we upload all of our full uncut streams and playlists, so feel free to check it out. First channel is our main content, second channel is our full uncut streams. All organized in playlists. This away. Damn, Mario, okay, what a gentleman. It's been so long since I've seen these guys fight, it's like, jarring. They all act like their characters. They do! That's the best thing about this playthrough, it's like everybody acts like how they would act. <clears throat> hearing say, hearing San say, come on team is very cursed. Damn, we got hella food. Let's go. Hey, don't push. Chaos job. Chaos John's big ass eyes. Wait, Midna actually wants to talk to Bomb True Girl? Hold up. This is very strange. Very strange interactions occurring today. We should agree on some rules for our room. We should. We shouldn't leave the room in a mess. Well, duh. We shouldn't break any things in the room. I'll protect them with my life. 
We shouldn't paint the room. Well, that's debatable. Yeah, they're gonna gossip about Link. True. I don't want Cash trying to be by herself, actually. That makes me sad. Uh, <clears throat> so, what were we doing here? Oh, yeah, Bendy. Oh, God, I forgot why we were even here. So, Bendy told us that his friend Waluigi found a mysterious gem and got kidnapped by a monster. But the monster is deep within the icy mountains. So, Milky Chan and the gang went to the icy mountains because we're trying to save Waluigi. Which is a little strange because Waluigi should be with King bob but we don't really know the full story about that. Uh, maybe there's two Waluigis? But unfortunately, when they were exploring the cave, a big uh, avalanche occurred, and the group got separated. So Milky-chan and the gang and Mario and the gang got separated, and now they are currently looking to meet up. Will they be able to meet up and reunite? Will they find Waluigi? And will they get one final step closer? to fighting Omega Ouija and saving the world. Well, all of those questions and more shall be answered on the next episode of Milky Metopia. <laughs>